have you ordered the release of the uh, accused or the convicts in the Chong sisters' rape slaying case? Namely, Astar, ba Balansag, Caño, Alberto Caño, alias Alan Pahak, Ariel, Bala is this Balansag or Josman Asnar? Three of them. I cannot remember ordering uh, release of, because I do not really distinguish what cases this PDL is. Well, I'll show you the release orders. Ah. Signed for by Maria P. Marquez. This is the release order issued in favor of the convicts in the case of the Chong sisters rape slaying. Sa Cebu, yeah. This is a celebrated case, you know. The same thing. Two super this is a memorandum. No? Paragraph number four again. Submit report of compliance to the Office of the Director General of the Bureau of Corrections within five days from the actual date of release, copy furnished the chief document section. Date August 16, 2019. Question Have they been released? Yes, Your Honor. Oh. Eh, di pareho rin. Yung unang release order kay Sanchez na preempt lang because of the public uproar. But in this case, this one got away because this was dated four days before the supposed or the release order signed by you in favor of Antonio Sanchez. So what makes the difference between the release order signed for you by Maria P. Marquez and the release order signed by you in favor of Antonio Sanchez? The other one, of course, Antonio Sanchez, as we all know by now, has not been released because of the outcry. But in the case of the Chong sisters, and they're crying for justice, no? we, we, uh, we saw them on TV. And the, uh, the case of the Chong sisters you know, is as gruesome as the uh, case of, the, uh, uh, of Eileen Sarmenta and Alan Gomez. So anyway, I would just like, for the re just for the record, to point that out, Mr. Chairman. Now, we go to same question. Under the law, you are the only one authorized no, under the law. I think this is uh, Article 98, no, no, Article 99, as amended by Section 5 of GCTA of 10592. No? who grants time allowances. Ito yung Section 5 na uh, amending Article 99. Because sa Article 99, kayo lang po yung authorized. No? Pero in-expand dito, uh, isinama yung uh, chief of the BJMP. No? Why? Because siguro sa batas, sinasama yung good conduct time allowance sa preventive imprisonment. So siguro kaya in-expand yung, uh, yung uh, authorized to sign or to grant uh, good contact time allowance uh, sinama yung BJMP and uh, even the provincial wardens no, kasama. Okay. So under the law, you are the only one authorized to sign release orders or to grant uh, allowances. Is that correct? Yes, Your Honor. As and as therefore, as Maria P. Marquez violated the law by signing the release orders of the uh, uh, offenders or the uh, convicts in the Chong sisters' uh, rape slaying case. Did she violate the law? I, I would like to uh, carefully address that, Your Honor, because... Uh, yeah, because the law is very clear. Eh? The Aside from the director of the BJMP, kayo lang po yung authorized, the other per person authorized, and no other person is, uh, mentioned in the law even in, the, uh, in Article 99 of the Revised Penal Code and the amendatory law, which is the 10592, hindi kasama. And ako hindi rin ako abogado, pero ang alam ko what the law excludes, it does not include. 